The abdominal wall is more than just your six pack. In fact, there are four layers of muscle that go into creating this anterior section. And due to the way the muscle fibre direction runs, they collectively form a large muscular girdle. Let's look at these ones first. We're going to start at the deepest muscle and make our way to the most superficial. Transverse abdominis, or you can call it the TVA for short. Origin, iliac crest, lumbar vertebrae and ribs. Insertion, pubic crest and linear alba. The muscle fibre direction runs in a transverse or horizontal manner. So when the TVA contracts, it creates a squeezy mechanism, thus increasing the amount of pressure in the abdomen. Since the TVA attaches to the vertebrae, it is a vital muscle for the overall stability of the lumbar spine and the pelvis. When the TVA contracts, the intra-abdominal pressure creates a lifting effect on the vertebra. It is this pressure, coupled with the lifting, that protects the lumbar vertebrae. The TVA is also used to help with forced expiration, which is when you actively force your breath out, like when you breathe out forcefully during very heavy weights. Again, this forced expiration during heavy lifts is another means of protecting the spine via its pressure mechanism. Sometimes you may hear the core as being described as the inner unit. What this is actually referring to are the deep muscles of the core and are the ones that provide the most stability to the spine and the pelvis. You can think of the inner unit being like a paint can. The body of the can is the transverse abdominis, and the seal at the back of the can is the multifidus, a muscle which is responsible for segmental stability. The bottom of the can is the pelvic floor, and the lid of the can is the diaphragm. When these muscles are functioning properly, they provide trunk and spine stability, and provide a strong platform for the bigger, more global muscles. The TVA also merges into the thoracolumbar fascia, a big word, but let's break that down. Thoro meaning thoracic, co meaning and, lumbar referring to the lumbar region, so thoracic lumbar fascia. As you will recall, fascia is the cobweb-like connective tissue that connects the body and in particular the thoracolumbar fascia is large and can be seen from the back. When you refer to your anatomy pictures, you will see the large white area in the lumbar region. This is your thoracolumbar fascia. It is of importance because it has three layers and provides attachment for some of the abdominal muscles, like the TVA, and other muscles of the back. And when the inner unit muscles are activated, it pulls on this fascia, creating your body's own natural weightlifting belt.